Welcome to our Crypto Weekly Wrap, where we bring to you the top news from the crypto ecosystem every week. Let's dive right into the news updates for this week. In a recent development, Solana Foundation has denied the claims of the SEC that its native token SOL is a security token. The foundation has denied these allegations and said that SOL is in fact a utility token used to power the Solana blockchain. This issue further highlights the regulatory challenges that are ongoing in the United States for crypto companies. Polygon introduces its 2.0 roadmap to enable secure and instantaneous cross-chain interoperability among off-chain networks. This will introduce new utility for the MATIC token and also improve governance within the community. A significant development, Ether, the world's largest issuer of stablecoin, has converted $750 million worth of USDT from the Tron blockchain to the Ethereum blockchain. The total supply of USDT will, however, remain the same. This development follows after Tether mints $1 billion worth USDT on the Ethereum blockchain recently. Uniswap, the leading decentralized exchange, has launched its FIFO version. This will introduce hooks or contracts at various points of a liquidity pool life cycle. In Uniswap, every liquidity pool has a life cycle where liquidity can be added or removed based on how users swap tokens. With hooks, the liquidity can be customized in various ways. That's all for this week's news. If you found this interesting, don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our channel for more updates coming your way.